Wives who seek counseling regarding their husband's addiction to pornography are no longer considering porn as an innocent habit that all men participate in. And the reason is simple. They have now realized the dangerous effects that pornography had caused to their marital relationships. They have now noticed that their husbands have been treating them just like sex objects for their own pleasures. Not only that, but they have also noticed that their husbands have been requesting from them to engage in unnatural and unusual forms of degrading sexual acts that they were not used to before. And that is what pornography does. It twists our understanding of the real marital intimacy between spouses. The problem now is that most men who view pornography, if not all, believe that this is normal and that women actually enjoy this type of sexual activity, including anal intercourse and causing them to feel pain through beating and slapping and so on. That's what pornography teaches and this is how the marital relationship is ruined. For all women who are listening to me right now, remember this. Remember this very, very well. If your husbands have requested from you to engage in an unusual, unnatural sexual activity, then this perhaps is your indication that he's been watching pornography and most likely he's been addicted to it. The twisted form of sexual intimacy promoted by pornography could lead to dangerous crimes against women as well, including rape, torture, and emotional harm, because this is exactly what they show in their production. And so a person who constantly watches these scenes may end up acting out what he has been watching, leading him to a lifetime behind bars. Their brains have become conditioned that sexual pleasure is only attainable through porn and masturbation. And as a result, many of them have suffered from what is called erectile dysfunction or the inability of performing sexually with a partner. Imagine this with me. A person who found pornography enjoyable because he is sexually excited may end up being prevented completely from having sex at all. These problems are serious and very damaging to marriages and marital relationships. Not only that, it could become a very harmful to women's self-esteem and self-worth because when their husbands are unable to perform sexually, in most cases, most wives would be blaming themselves for not being attractive enough. The damaging of marital relationships caused by pornography is real. But what has been mentioned is sufficient for you to quit and seek some help. I believe this is more than enough for you to take a decision. So what's your decision?